It's the Kit Lab, you're back with your boy AK. And today, like I promised you last week, we are doing a play test with the new R9 Heritage ID Mercurial from Nike. Are you actually ready for this? I don't think so, let's go. At a time where leather boots were normal, the existence of the Mercurial came about because of R9 and its blistering pace. Nike needed a new boot to handle and support the Brazilian striker's feet. And if you'd worn Super 5 360s then, with the Chevron pods, you'd have seen the ground literally light up behind him as he rocketed past defenders. What about with a ball? Imagine, 6 foot 2, built like an ox, yet had greater dribbling ability than Neymar Jr. Yeah, I said it. Half our goalkeeper technician is about to get me doing a madness. And whether at full speed or stuck in a tricky situation, our nice close control dribbling to get past multiple opponents was insane. A flying it upper would have meant even more ball feel. So can you imagine his touch then? Out of this universe. As for his finishing, one of the greatest finishers the world has ever seen, whether using finesse or laces. With 467 goals, 62 of which were Brazil, he could pretty much find the net from absolutely anywhere in and around the box. But his specialty, 1v1s with the keeper. In fact, his record for going around the keeper is 88 times in his career. And yes, he scores at the end of it, of course. There's a reason why he's called phenomenal. There you have it, guys. That was the R9 play test completed. Now, note to self, I'm not bad at striking a ball, but I'm nowhere near the greatest of all time, if I do say so myself. Now, the boot itself, we all know, the Superfly 360 is probably one of the best boots out there at the moment, hands down, and one of the best Mercurials ever made. What we didn't know is that in 2016, there was already a Mercurial Heritage ID in the Superfly 4 version. And what I'm about to tell you is this. This ID pack, for me, is actually better. I mean, before I had a black collar compared to the silver one now, um, but the graphics on here stand out amazingly well and there's such a good representation of the original version from 1998. So I have absolutely no complaints with the boot itself. Let me know what you think. Do you think this is the best mercurial of all time? And do you think that this is the best colorway you'll ever see on the boot, as in the most iconic? Put that in the comments below, give us a massive thumbs up and subscribe to us here in the Kit Lab. I'm AK, catch you in the next one. Peace. <laughs>